Stranger Things has been a phenomenon ever since it first hit Netflix back in 2016. Every year the show has been attracting more and more attention from viewers. It seems everyone is a fan of the 80s nostalgia horror series, and this latest season was a powerhouse performance from everyone involved. A while back, we landed interviews with Tristan Spoon, who played 2, and Mary Blair, who played a younger version of Eleven. They were both lovely to speak to, be sure to check those out. Real fast, before we get into it, like, subscribe, and crack that notification bell. Right. Stranger Things Season 4 was released on Netflix this year and ended up breaking all sorts of records for the streamer. But what about Stranger Things Season 5? We know that Season 5 is in the works over at Netflix, and here's everything we know about the upcoming season of the show. The show's creator, the Duffer Brothers, stated in an interview with The Hollywood Reporter that Season 4 will not be the end of the show, which was also confirmed by Netflix. Here's what Ross Duffer had to say about continuing Stranger Things after Season 4. Season 4 won't be the end. We know what the end is, and we know when it is. The pandemic has given us time to look ahead, figure out what's best for the show. Starting to fill that out gave us a better idea of how long we need to tell that story. We already know, thanks to the Duffer Brothers, that Season 5 will be the show's final season. We also know, thanks to Peter Freelander, Netflix's head of scripted series for US and Canada, that the last season of the show will not be released weekly. As for a release date for Season 5, that's harder to pin down than usual. Stranger Things hasn't exactly been consistent with their releases, which is fine since they always give us an excellent season, and they haven't even started shooting the final season. However, the Duffer Brothers did give TV Line a planned start date for shooting. Here's what they had to say. I'm not sure we're ready to say yet a start date for shooting, but a lot of it is pretty well mapped out. We've learned a lot just working with all of our new actors and the ones we've worked with for a long time over this year. So I'm sure it'll change a little bit from that outline. The ending is the hard thing. That's obviously the stressful thing. We really want to stick the landing. The Duffer Brothers and some people at Netflix might be the only people who know what will happen. David Harbour might also know a thing or two. Here's what he said in an interview with Gold Derby. If we're ever able to film again, there's a lot to be revealed around the complexities of Hopper's story, which is really rich, and I'm really excited for you to see. You'll be able to go back and watch it and see, you know, what we were planting in Season 3 that paid off in Season 4 and Season 5. We're just hoping that there'll at least be some sort of happy ending for Jim's sake. We think that there'll be an interesting story arc for Jim Hopper which will carry on into Season 5. Also, we're hoping that Eleven will finally get the answers she's been seeking her whole life. Why was she experimented on? Why was she chosen? Where did her powers come from? There are so many questions that need answering, and we think they'll be answered in Stranger Things Season 5. Are you looking forward to watching Stranger Things Season 5 when it's released on Netflix? Let us know your thoughts in the comments, we do read all of them. And as always, remember to like, subscribe, and quack that notification bell to keep up with our news and exclusives. Thanks for watching, and see you next time! Rest in peace, Eddie.